I'm gonna go for it. This is a little bit risky of a play. Warfist, if I get Valderrama killed, I apologize, but I think this is the way we want to go. Uh, if we come right here, we should definitely be flanking. Are you good? If not, let's get good. It's Tuesday night, and that means that I am playing XCOM Long War. So, based on some advice from Remy Rudenberg, I acquired a couple of more aircrafts that are now covering our continent, so we now have three on each. You're keeping our eyes out for high flyers that will shoot down our satellites. And I have prepared a squad for our light abduction mission in Nice, France. Now, I did look at the mission hint in the upper left corner. It is an urban large structure, single large building that will require entry. Sounds like a place that snipers will not be that useful. So today, here's our squad. We have Specialist Lanuza, who is sponsored by Melvin the Paranoid. Specialist Hokusai, who is sponsored by Remy Rudenberg. Lance Corporal Creed, who is sponsored by Evil Mistress. Lance Corporal Valderrama, who is sponsored by Gorefist. Specialist Golami, who is sponsored by Fable Scroll Productions. And Lance Corporal Bebe, who is sponsored by Darius Wolf. You will note that Bebe has a battle rifle now instead of a shotgun because I have learned the error of my ways. So let's talk about kits real quick. Everybody is pretty much wearing heavy armor. Lanuza is bringing a med kit and some ceramic plating because she is our gunner. She is there to provide suppression. And also as a backup med kit. Oh, I guess I don't need a... Well, I guess we don't need a backup med kit. So we're going to actually change that real quick. Um, what are we going to give you instead? Let's do a smoke grenade. Then we've got... <coughs> excuse me. And then we've got double medkits on Specialist Hokusai, along with an AP grenade. We've got double medkits on Luke, or Lance Corporal Creed, along with another smoke grenade. Lance Corporal Valderrama is bringing a flashbang and a motion detector since he will be leading the charge. Specialist Galami, this is actually really nice, is an engineer and is bringing both two HE grenades and two AP grenades because you can do that. That's amazing. And Lance Corporal Bebe is bringing a flashbang and an HE grenade. And let's begin the mission. I am really, really excited to try out this squad. I feel like the squad's going to do very, very well. The only thing I wasn't sure Strike about was one. bringing two Prepare medics, but at the end of the day, I want to level them both up fairly soon. This does mean they'll both be fatigued. That's okay, I think we have a couple request. more medics coming up the pipes, and if we don't, you guys medics can take care of that, right? Okay, so entries. here we are. Operation we First Chant. Alien abductions in Nice, France. Alright, your soldiers can kick in doors and jump through windows, but the resulting noise will alert nearby aliens. Yup, gotcha. So we are neutralizing enemies and capturing meld. I love seeing our guys get off the Sky Ranger. Okay, so here we are. Strike one has the green light for deployment. Said a large building that we're probably going to end up having to invade, so I'm guessing that that is the large building right there. And if that is the case, do we want to breach over here where we've got a door, or do we want to come check right here and see if we can spot anything? This is our first move of the round, or of the entire map actually. So I'm gonna have Valderrama, I think... Do I want to bring him to this full cover? Yeah, I'm gonna bring him to this full cover. Everyone will still have their moves if he detects anything. He did not. Okay, that is perfectly fine. And I think for this turn... I'm gonna turn on his motion tracker, actually. Ooh, okay, that is actually really, really useful. So we know that we've got x-rays down here. So Valderrama is in a really bad place if that is the case. I am going to instead move him down here. Oh, and we revealed the x-rays, which is fine, because all of the rest of our squad has their moves to make. Okay, so let's get everybody to cover. That is a big, big focus this round. We can get her to half cover right there, but I kind of like it better with her at full cover over here. Ooh, let's do that. I've yet to use smoke in this campaign, and I think now is probably a great time to do it. 
If I throw a smoke over here, that should help with the people that are going to be in half cover. And that's what I'm going to do. And then we're going to slowly move everybody forward. Hokusai, I can put you right there. I can put you right there. You're a medic. Probably better to keep you right here, maybe? How much cover does that actually grant? Is it based on the radius? Or I think it's okay. I think if we go right here, we should have decent cover from that smoke. Okay, then we've got Galami, who is our double grenades engineer. That's somebody that's good to have forward. Question is how forward? Actually, probably right there. Half cover with smoke should keep her relatively safe. And then we will send forward Lanuza. And Lanuza is our gunner, so we need her somewhere that she can suppress. She could suppress from right here if she even has... Well, let's move her there and see. Okay, so she doesn't have a suppression from right there, so we can probably move her forward pretty safely. The question is, do we want to, or do we want to go ahead and bring forward Bebe, who is our infantry with our battle rifle? So she needs to be in position because she doesn't want to move and shoot. Let's put Bebe up there. And I believe we still have a move with Lanuza. We do. There's not really anywhere great for her to get to. Like, this is sort of far and away, which makes it a little bit safer, but there's not any real great cover that she can run to from here. I think we just have to stay here. I think we stay here and we hunker down. That seems like a safe way to do that. Now hopefully the x-rays will reveal themselves. We don't have any overwatches, so yeah, they can move a little bit. We're relying on cover and smoke to keep us safe. I am really, really not comfortable doing that though. Like, that is new to me. Relying on smoke and half cover. Ugh. Oh, he got acid. That sucks. That sucks bad. Oh, that is so garbage. Miss. Good, 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 good. Psy Panic failed. But we do have some people that are affected by acid, I think. Uh, where does it show that? It doesn't... Sh it shows ceramic plating. Yeah, it's... Oh, okay, it's the, the down red arrow. So it looks like only Hokusai was affected by the acid. Which is good, because I believe that he can just heal Wound to get rid of it. At the same time, I'm not sure that that's even the move we want to make. I think the move we want to make might be to take some shots. Um, okay. Galami is up front with some grenades. I know we want to recover Thin Men corpses, but I also know that Thin Men are incredibly dangerous. I think what I want to do is see if we can use an HE grenade to take out this cover right here. Yeah, see, that's not going to take out that pillar. It won't do it. Um, okay. We could use it to take out... That stuff? No, that's not going to help either. <laughs> I'm having a lot of trouble using the HE grenades effectively. We could, however, use an anti-personnel grenade and just shred one of these thin men. Does four damage to units not in cover. Okay, well he's in cover, but we should be able to get around. Well, no. Darn it, I don't know. Um, what do we have for a shot? We have 37%, 36%, 36%. None of those shots are very good. Okay, we're gonna come back. We're gonna come back because I can't decide. I know that I want to fire with Bebe. I just don't know who at. God, why is it so low? Um, let's try something different then. Who's got a flashbang? You don't have a flashbang, do you? No, you have a smoke grenade. Do you have a flashbang? You do not have a flashbang. So we've got a flashbang there, and probably right here. Yeah, we've got a flashbang here. Oh, we've got a run and gun here that's pretty appetizing. Like if we run and gun right here and then shotgun, I think that we just, or even right here, I think that we just get the kill. There is the chance to reveal more enemies over here though. That kind of concerns me a little bit. Let's do this. Let's run here and then see if we want to activate run and gun. Uh, I think we have to. I think if we do, it's a good thing here. I'm gonna go for it. This is a little bit risky of a play. 
Warfist, if I get Valderrama killed, I apologize, but I think this is the way we want to go. Uh, if we come right here, we should definitely be flanking. 100% shot, get him. Nice job, Valderrama. Nice job. That is excellent. That is exactly what we wanted to happen. Now we could move here and try to get... Ooh. Ooh. We can move here. We won't get a flanking shot, unfortunately, but we should be able to get a pretty decent shot. Oh, no. We are getting a flanking shot. I'll take it. Um, Go, Hokusai. Shoot him. Very nice, Hokusai. Look at that, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Two x-rays down, we got one left. I might just move Galami up and get a shot. That is entirely viable. Moving. Let's do it. Uh, 41%, that is not entirely vi viable. I'm gonna leave Hokusai in case we need to AP grenade, but I don't want to. I would rather, ooh, I wonder what happens if, let's try this out. I've never used flashbangs, let's go ahead and use one. This is probably a wasteful way to use a flashbang. But I'm going to give it a shot anyway, because I want to see what it does. And he is disoriented. I don't know what that means, but I'm hoping it gives us a better chance to shoot him in the face. Not particularly, no. Okay, uh, that's not going to work. What do we have here? Oh, we can move over there and suppress that guy. Unfortunately, we don't have hollow targeting yet, or we don't have the ability that makes ho uh, hollow targeting apply on suppression, which would be really good. Uh, 47%, that's not a great shot. This is a coin f no, this is way less than a coin flip. How is that so much less than a coin flip and she's further away and has a better shot? Okay, Creed, this is it. Flip that coin. Frick, that's not what we needed. Damn it. Um, I guess we AP Grenade. It's probably the best option here. I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, Galami, do it, do it, do it. Chuck that grenade like you mean it. Very nice, Galami. Very nice. Okay, so everybody's soldiers are doing amazing. We've got kills by... Ooh, who got kills? Um... We got kills on Hokusai, so Remy's soldier gets a kill. Gora's soldier gets a kill, and Melvin's soldier racks up yet another kill. Okay, so now we probably want to regroup. I don't think, did anyone even fire? The only person I think that fired were the people that got kills, and Sybil who missed. But that is okay, because she had a low shot. Alright, you reload, let's get everybody nice and reloaded. That motion scanner is absolutely incredible. I can't believe I wasn't using that before. That thing is amazing. Oh, that's bad. But at least everybody... No, everybody does not have blue moves. Oh, that's bad. That's really, really bad. Um, what can we do with an HE grenade here? How much cover can we blow up? Not a whole lot. Uh, we can overwatch. That's something. Who's got turns left? Oh, this is not good. This is not good. That was a huge, huge mistake on my part. Um, let's see if we can't provide a little bit of extra cover to these guys right here. Another chance to use these smoke grenades to great effect. Oh, this is bad. He is in a bad, bad spot. But let's get him some smoke and hopefully it'll all work out. It probably won't. That is a terrible, terrible mistake on my part. I'm gonna put her on Overwatch because she is infantry and she has not moved. And I'm hoping that if they try to move through, we will get a shot. At the very least... Okay, good, good, good. They both Overwatch. That gives us a chance to move our soldiers into a safer position. Oh, is he getting damaged from... He is. He's getting damaged from the acid. Okay, let's have him heal wound on himself. There we go. Acid has been neutralized. That's perfect. He's in a safe position, so we're not really worried about it too much. Okay, and these guys are overwatching. We don't want to take that shot. It's not a good shot. I think we steady. Let's steady. And we've got Lanuza to move. I wonder if she can get there if we bring our medic forward a little bit. Yeah, let's bring our medic up here. 
And does she have any shots or anything? She does not, so we'll overwatch with her because she's in a good spot for it. Now, Valderrama, if he runs... I can't remember... Oh, God. I am still, like, learning the classes. There we go, there we go, there we go. He's got Run and Gun and Steadfast. Neither one of those is going to help us here. Crap, if we move him, there's a good chance they shoot. Do we jut to cover right here? Is that the play? Or do we try to jut him back? This is full cover. I think we just jut to... Oh, that's two Overwatch shots, though. But it is through smoke. Go. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay, so that did not screw us like I thought it would. I wonder what happens if we... Yeah, let's flashbang. If we can, can we get a flashbang over to them? No, we can't. Okay, we're gonna have to move to do that. That's fine. But right now, I think it's good to just go ahead and put him on Overwatch. I know I rely too heavily on Overwatch normally, but I don't feel like that's what I'm doing here. I feel like here the Overwatches are smart, and they're being used mainly to keep these guys from moving while we set up the battle the way we want to. Oh, that, that guy was able to move out. Interesting. Ooh, that was a good miss. That was a good miss for us. Okay, that was a very good miss for us. Hopefully our infantry has a shot here now. I, I'm kind of treating our infantry like a sniper a little bit, and that makes me kind of feel like I'm doing something wrong. I definitely don't think she's meant to just kind of sit there the whole time. Ooh, that is a coin flip, but a coin flip for a kill. Or, or, let's see if we've got an HE grenade anywhere nearby. We've got a flashbang. That's not really what we want. Neither is that. Do we have an HE grenade? Does anybody have an HE? Yes, we do. But it's you. You are the one that is able to take that shot, too. If she moves, there's a pretty good chance that she'll trigger the Overwatch. I'm not sure how to tell precisely what will and what won't. Okay, let's see what we can do with an HE grenade. We can do some serious, serious damage. We can blow up all the cover. And I think, yeah, let's do that. Maybe if we tag it, it'll pull it out of Overwatch. Grenade! I doubt it, but it's worth a try. Let's go. Boom. Okay, we tagged it for one. That did not pull it out of Overwatch, but it does not have cover now. Unfortunately, I don't think we have a shot on it to capitalize with. Ogasai should be out of range. That's fine. I'm going to have him steady so that maybe we rush him ahead next turn and try to get that shot. Ah, oh, Sybil has no shot. Valderrama has no shot. What if he comes Boy. over here? Does he have a shot then? No, he does not. Darn it. Okay, fine. Let's... Oh, we're going to blow our last grenade right here on this. I don't think that's worth it. I'm just going to overwatch because I don't want to blow our last flashbang on that. Okay, let's bring Lanuza forward. She can just go ahead and reload right now because we don't need her to steady or anything at this moment. I keep, you know, I'm in this situation where, Bebe, I want to bring her forward. I really want to bring her forward, but I'm worried that I'm going to move her into that overwatch. Standard shots no longer end the turn if taken as the first action. So I think I'm playing the infantry rather badly. I think I should have been moving her forward sooner. But considering we don't have any guaranteed shots on that particular x-ray, I don't really want to move her right now. <clears throat> we could move Creed up here, but that's going to put her in danger once again. Um, let's steady. Steadying seems like a good idea. In this case, I want to move her kind of back. Hopefully this doesn't trigger good. Okay, that did not trigger... Actually, let's see if we can... No, 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 no. Nope. Steady, please. That'd be perfect. And if he moves, we've got a good chance at... No, we don't have a good chance at overwatches, but he's overwatching on us again, and he's in cover, so we basically just completely did not make good use of the HE grenade. Ooh, the mind fray failed, the mind fray failed. That was excellent. That would have been really bad for us if that hadn't failed. Okay, who's up, who's up, who's up, who's on base? Creed is up. You should have a shot on someone. That is a 39%. I don't know why that is a 39%, but it is. What happens if we go here? Do we get shot at? We probably do. Not gonna take that risk. What I might do, though, 
and I'm not sure if this will work. I don't know if moving Valderrama is going to trigger that guy or not. Oh, we can flashbang though, and now they should be in a spot where we could probably hit them. Oh, we can hit the one back there. I don't want to hit the one back there, I want to hit that one. Oh, you know what, we can move to the other side and flashbang. I like that, let's do that. And flashbang the guy who is trying to overwatch. And then we'll get a good position on him and take a shot. Nice and disoriented, just the way we like it. Okay, so Hokusai, you need to come forward. So does Bebe. I think we bring Bebe here. That seems like a pretty good place. She doesn't have a shot, so we'll overwatch. We can move Creed forward. And if she has a good shot, we'll take it. That's 63, that's not a great shot. Let's jump over to Galami and see if Galami can get a better shot from like over here. I bet you we can. I bet you we get a pretty decent... Well, it's a 54%. Flip that coin, Galami. Get him. Get him. Good job, Galami. Oh, he landed on the rack. I love it. He landed on the rack. That was pretty funny. Okay, so we have Creed, who does not have a shot. We'll go ahead and overwatch with her. Hopefully this guy decides to move and walks right into a flood of bullets. I'm gonna rush Ho uh, Hokusai up here to catch him up with the rest of the group. And then I will... Let's see, Lanuza, what do we want to do with you? I kind of want you more forward, but safe more forward. Like, I don't feel like that right there is quite safe, or that necessarily. Oh, you know what, we can come here. Yeah, let's go double sides on this lift. We should have a pretty good chance of just taking this guy out cold if he try. Oh, he ran. He ran, and I have a feeling that if we go there, we're going to reveal more x-rays, but we have... That is an x-ray thing over there, too, so we've got to be careful, because there could be more x-rays anywhere. Let's motion track her real quick and see what we can find. Doesn't look like we've got any other signals. That's a good thing, I think. Okay, let's move forward here. And go ahead and overwatch. Yeah, so at this point, like, I think everybody is mostly reloaded. You do need to reload, so you go ahead and do that. And we're basically just moving everybody forward. And trying to corner that last x-ray. I don't know if he's the last x-ray in the mission, but he could very well be. Okay, so we need to... We kind of want to rush our infantry into a spot with good cover. And we may be able to do that by moving Creed over here. Let's do that. And we'll put Creed on Overwatch 2, just in case that guy decides to come back. Rush Hokusai up here. And let's get Bebe over here. That way, if the guy moves back forward, Bebe should have a shot next turn. Okay, alien activity. That's always a good sign. Oh, there's a meld canister out this way too, but I think it might be gone. Like, that might be that we just lost it. Whatever. Meld is not worth a soldier's life. Um, okay, what do we have? There are no walls here. I have destroyed all of our cover because I am bad at this game. Um, okay, you can rush up here. Actually, you know what? The person who should rush up here is probably Valderrama. Let's come up like this. There's the reveal that we were expecting. And now we're gonna go ahead and run and... No, we don't need to run and gun because we're not gonna be able to get a shot with a run and gun there anyway. I'm going to just tuck Valderrama into this corner here. Uh, we've got Hokusai behind this car. This is... Is this full cover? It is full cover. Is Sybil behind full cover? She is. Okay, so we're just going to wait, because, like, we can just sit here and wait for them to walk into the wave of bullets. And we can get half cover there, which I'm not super fond of. We can get full cover here. That seems like a good play. And we will go ahead and overwatch. Now we do have the option of exploding things if we need to, but I don't feel like we're quite there yet. I kind of want to dash her right there. Because if I can keep her in full cover there without them blowing up that cover, she can totally, totally begin suppressing. That's what we're going to do. Okay, and now we have our infantry, and I kind of want to move her there. We have overwatches? We do have overwatches. I could move her there. It's not super safe, but it's not incredibly unsafe either. Um, yeah, I think this is why Darius always tells me that infantry die. 
Okay, let's move her forward. I can't resist the urge. We've got a couple overwatches to cover. She's got good range on them now so that she can shoot before she moves. Plenty of options here. So really all I'm doing is trying to set up good options because I think these are the last group of x-rays. Oh, really? Steadfast triggered though. There you go. Steadfast being amazing. Bebe is a boss. She is not afraid, Lance. She's... Er, Arius, but whatever, you guys know his name is Lance. Oh, and again, Steadfast paying off. Do you see that, Darius? That is amazing. You picked it well. Uh, don't shoot her. Do oh, are you kidding me? Wow, they made three attempts to panic her and finally succeeded. But, on the upside, that's three attempts they made doing absolutely nothing combat-wise. So who are we suppressing? This guy, maybe? Yeah, let's suppress him. God, I wish we had the suppress that does more. The suppress that does more is amazing. Okay, so we've got Valderrama now. He can run and gun. I don't know that that is a good decision, though, based upon what we know about where they're at. Uh, he could move forward to this half cover, but that seems like a really bad idea. Let's take him up to this full cover right here. And, oh, he's not gonna have a shot there. That's fine, that's fine. Oh, and she is just hurting right now. We need to get a medic up there pronto. Or some smoke, but we don't have any smoke. Let's get a medic up there and seat it right there. That should keep Creed safe long enough to heal her. That's exactly what we want to focus on doing. Okasai could cover here with some overwatch fire, or we could start working with Galami. I think we can do some good stuff with Galami. Aye, aye, Commander. Oh god, Galami's in a bad, bad spot right there, though. That is a very bad spot. Um, let's go ahead and move Galami here. That's a little bit better. And Hokusai, I kind of want to rush him forward, but I kind of don't. I need good cover for him, and there's not really that much available. So I think what I'm going to do is just overwatch so that they don't try to rush us. Okay, they've got an overwatch. Miss, that's a good thing. That is a very good thing. Okay, we've got another shot here, but he's suppressed. Yup, gotta love suppression. Suppression is absolutely phenomenal. And the panic is gone, maybe? Nope, she's still panicked. Okay, that's fine. Let's heal her wounds. It's okay, baby. You got this. You... You survived and persisted through three panic attempts before finally succumbing. I think you are wonderful, and you did great. Okay, who's next? Let's see, who's on first? Lanuza, do you have a shot? You have a 47, a 32. Uh, you have a suppression. Please continue suppressing fire on that guy, and we're gonna try to take out the guy that is over here. And I think the way we're gonna do that is by having Galami come out here and chuck a bomb to take his cover away. That seems like a good idea, not a bomb, a grenade. Why doesn't it show the wall exploding? The wall's gonna explode, I know it is. But we want to be careful because we don't want to take too much of our cover away, and we want to try to avoid specifically killing him, but if we don't get that cover, then we're kind of screwed, so we need to get the cover without killing him, like that. Okay, here we go. Here's hoping. Come on, baby, you can do this. That's what I'm talking about. That is exactly what I'm talking about. 84% with the shotgun, go. Go, go, Valderrama, go. Boom, headshot. Lovely, that's exactly what we want to see. Okay, they've got one guy who is overwatching. Shoot, I should have suppressed him. But our entire squad has moved except for Hokusai, who can't really do much. Not at this point. So I'm gonna have him go ahead and steady, because what we might do is rush in with him next turn to try to get a good shot. Yup, that's dangerous. Oh, that's a failed Psy Panic. Okay, good, 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 good. Whiff, whiff, whiff. Yes, 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 yes. For a minute there I got scared because I saw those destroyed walls and she was standing out and I was like, oh no, she doesn't have cover, she's totally dead. But that is not how things went down, fortunately. There's full c nope, that's half cover. 
Okay, so we don't have great shots just yet on everyone, but we can get some. It is dangerous to move that far forward right there. What do we have here? 51, a 36. We take the 51. Go ahead, Galami, flip that coin. Three damage. Just barely missed him. Well, you didn't miss him. You got him, but you didn't finish him. Um, yeah, let's have you suppress that guy, because we're going to try to kill the other one. Now, how do we get a good angle to kill this guy? Oh, Bebe's got a shot. 62%. Go ahead, Bebe, take your shot. You got this. Revenge is sweet, isn't it, Bebe? You have just shot him in the face like he deserves. Oh, and she can go again. She can go again. That's incredible. I'm going to steady so that she gets a better shot next to me. Um, we can come down here. That's going to leave us in half cover, which I'm not super happy about. But that guy is being suppressed, and this guy might come through the window, so we've got a good overwatch right here. I'm going to do it. And then with Valderrama, we can probably bring him over here and either overwatch or take a shot. 51, 15. Let's go ahead and overwatch. Just so that we have some more shots waiting if that guy decides to come forward. And now we're going to go ahead and pull Hokusai forward here to full cover. I am trying to be mindful of the different covers and make sure that our guys are pretty much always in full. Unless, of course, we have extenuating circumstances like the suppressing fire that is holding this guy down. Oh, he's just hunkering. That's pretty funny. He is hunkering, and what do we have here? Do we have anyone with an explosive left? We do. Okay, so here's what I think we're going to do. Oh, where do we go? Here? I think we're going to go here with Creed. And then I think we're going to come back and grab Lanuza, and we are going to start chucking HE grenades where they need to go. Ooh, we could take out that tire rack. But I kind of need to take out that wall that this guy is behind, too. Um, this, I think this is a more pressing issue. We're going to do this. Chuck that grenade. And if we have another one, we can always take out the tire rack, too. There we go. No cover for you. 97%. Get him, Creed. Nice kill, Creed. Nice kill. Evil Mistress racks up another kill on the board. Okay, so Valderrama, you are right here. Who do we have with an HE grenade? Nobody. But Hokusai, I don't know if you've gotten a kill yet this, this mission. And I'd like to see you get one. So the first thing I'm going to do is... Oh, we can't suppress. We need to reload. Okay, so go ahead and reload. We can't suppress. What we can do, though, is Overwatch to ensure he's not going to move. And put Hokusai right here, where he's got a pretty good angle, and see if we get a shot. A 1% shot? How is that even possible? Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and overwatch... No, no, steady. I'm gonna steady with Hokusai, because I want to make sure he gets a kill. Okay. He needs a kill to get some experience so he can level up, because he's going to be one of our first officers. If not, our first officer. Okay, Golami, you are over here. And this guy can't do a whole lot. He's gonna... Oh, God, he hit Valderrama, but Valderrama is steadfast and is not sweating it at all. Good job, Valderrama. Okay, you are up, sir. Let's see. Do we just balls it with Hokusai and shoot? I think Can we I do. Just We're just gonna charge in and take that shot. How is that not flanking? Whatever, shoot him. He didn't die. He didn't die. Okay, I tried to give Hokusai that kill. It obviously did not work out. To Let's see if we can finish this fight with Galami. 66% flip that coin. We only need one of you to hit. Good job, Galami. You got this. Nice. Nobody went down. Excellent, excellent. That was so much better than my previous missions. We got hit twice. It happened. We got hit. Well, and one of them was a stupid mental attack I couldn't do anything about. But that last one where Valderrama got shot, that was on me because I thought we had our suppressor, but she was out of ammo. So that is it for this episode, guys. Thank you, Remy, once again for the feedback. Thank you, Darius, for the feedback. All the feedback you guys are giving me, I am integrating into the game. I do not have a research plan yet, but I am working on one. We did just unlock the containment cell, and now we are working on the, the zapper to capture aliens. And I'm going to focus in on that because I want to get those research credits because they make the early research so much easier. Keep gaming responsibly.